Hey guys, it's Town RC one um, uh, with Triple Threat RC here with a helpful tip on the Traxxas two wheel drive slash. Um, um, I was just gonna say when you get the truck, it will have um, obviously gearing in it, and it will come with let's get it out, with this right here. It will come with this. Now the gearing in it right now will run about 24, 25 miles an hour. Now if you put this in it, it will go 30. Um, the gearing in it have uh, the gearing in it right now has a lot more torque than the, than this gearing. This gearing will give you more top speed, um, not as much low end torque. Um, so this is more um, this is more for the track setup. Um, I'm just going to see what the 30 miles an hour is like. Um, so today we're going to switch out the spur and pinion. Um, and I'll show y'all how to do that. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take the tire off so it'll be a little bit faster. Just got my little wrench. And once that's off, just set that over to the side. And um, you're going to undo screw right there and then that screw right there to get the gear cover off let's set this over a little bit to get the gear cover off So you got that screw out. This will just completely pop off here. And um there's your gearing. Um what now? You know, after you do that, I'd go ahead and put the never mind, I won't say that. Alright. Now once you're done with that, you are going to want to I'm just gonna go ahead and take off the pinion gear. And then do the spur. There's the pinion. Pinion is now off. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> and undo the slipper clutch. Slipper clutch, spring. Once you get that out, you got that. Oh, that popped out right there. All right, and then once you're done with that, take your big wrench and do these. These three bolts right here, and then there's some bearings in the middle. Undo those three bolts, go ahead and take them out. This will pop off it's right here. Get this little thing and pry this off. That'll come off and get the bearing, pop it out, <clears throat> and then all your gearing is out. Now you get your new gearing that you got here, and just put it on just like you had it. Put this on, and this is actually your brake pads. Um, almost like calipers on a car this is basically what that is I believe and so put the screws so, back in. So right now um, I'm actually just seeing I'm just uh, gonna put the 30 mile an hour gearing in it just to see if it's really a dramatic 
dramatic change. Oh yeah, put the bearing back in. Grr. Okay, this little pad will not want to stay on. Alright, get that on. Spring, screw, put the slipper clutch on. And um, if I did read the manual right, <clears throat> you do. You do. Tighten it all the way. I believe I tighten all the way and then do half a turn backwards. Oh, sorry. I'll show you that again. Alright, you got it all the way tight. Half a turn backwards. And then get your new pinion. Slide in on there. I mean, as you can see, this is not hard at all. You're just changing out those two. I'm just tightening that little bolt on the pinion right now. 